Hey guys, Matt here and welcome back to the Game Gengu Vocabulary Series. In this video, we're going to be breaking down all of the Japanese we come across in a game chosen by you, the community. If you'd like to vote for which game you want to see next, make sure to join the Game Gengu Discord community over on the website or through Patreon. And the winner of this month is Final Fantasy X. In this video, we're going to be covering 74 pieces of N5 vocabulary, 41 and 4, 70 and 3, 11 and 2, 21 and 1, and 91 additional pieces of vocabulary not in the JLPT, putting our total words covered in this episode at 308, and finally hitting 25% a quarter of the entire JLPT covered in this series. So finally we're returning back to Final Fantasy X, sorry for the long wait, and so this is technically part 3, although you don't necessarily have to watch the previous episodes. In the last episode Titus was just on a ship and it got attacked by Sin, and now he's been shipwrecked. This is a very colourful episode where we meet a few new characters, so without further ado, let's jump right into Final Fantasy X in Japanese. Okay, so starting things off, we have one of the new characters here on the beach waving over at Titus and he's saying, Daijoubu ka? So, Daijoubu, we already know, means to be okay, to be alright. And we can see this here with the dictionary that I'm using, Lorenzi's Jisho. This is a very nice dictionary that shows the kind of frequency rankings of words. You can see how useful a certain word is in different categories, as well as even showing things like pitch accent and stuff. And he finishes off with a ka, and this is asking a question, a very direct question. So, are you alright? Daijoubu ka? <laughs> Hito! Hito! So Hito is person. So he's saying there's people! Hey, people! Hito! So as the ball flies past this character, he turns over and he says, Suge! So Suge is just Sugoi amazing. And we can see it said with a little bit of emphasis because it has this small tsu that's kind of putting a gap. Instead of Suge, it's Suge. So there's this kind of emphasis to what he's saying. Whoa! Domo. Oh man, this area is so beautiful. It's complete polar opposite of the previous episode where it was all dark and gloomy. Now we have beautiful beachside. So Titus greets these guys and he says, Yo, Domo. So Yo is like, hey. And then Domo here is short for Domo. We can see these can be both used like in definition number one to say thank you or thanks. However, here it's being used in the bottom definition as a greeting. Hello. Yo, Domo. Oh, my. <laughs> and this guy's very impressed by Titus or Titus's blitz ball here and he says, oh, Omae, Saki no waza, moikai yatte mi? So, Omae, you, Saki no is just previously, Saki no waza, waza is like a technique. This is a very common word that you'll see used in video games for the technique. So, Saki no waza, the previous technique, moikai, one more time, Yatte mi, and yatte miru is to try doing, but this yatte mi is actually short for yatte mi nasai, so telling someone to try doing it again, so, well, you, that technique just now, could you try doing it one more time? Oh, oh, my. 
Ureshikata. Ureshi here is to be happy, to be glad, and then Ureshikata I was. So he was glad. Kondo koso, tasukatta to omotta n da. So, kondo, this time koso, for sure, so this time for sure. Tasukatta, to be saved, to omotta, I thought, and then n da is explaining something. It is the case. So he thought it is that, this time for sure, he's saved. Ureshikata. Kondo koso, tasukatta to omotta n da. <laughs> And a very rude response from Titus. He just kicks their ball far, 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 far away. Who's gonna go pick up that ball? <laughs> you just met them and you're kicking their ball away. <laughs> It's so funny. So they're very impressed by what he did. A very impressive upside down kick, even though they'll never see the ball again. And this guy, he says, Shiroto j a n a i o na. Now, Shiroto is actually a new word that we have. This means an amateur, a novice. Janai, to not be your na. Right? So, wow, you're not an amateur, huh? And then he says, Doko no chimu da? So, doko, where, not the possessive particle. Chimu is a team, and then da here in a question, asking a very strong question. So, whose team are you? Shiroto じゃないよな Doko no chimu da? Zanaru Kando Abus. Doko no chimu da? Doko no chimu da? And Titus replies with Zanarukando Abes. So the Zanakand Abes. And so they seem to be quite shocked with his answer. And so he says, Dokkara kitatte. So, Dokkara is a combination of Doko kara, from where, kita, to have come. And then this te is now asking a question. He's quoting what he just said. So, kind of like, where is it again that you said you came from? Dokkara kitatte. Ah, warui. Ima no nashi. Ah, warui. Ima no nashi. So, warui is like my bad. Ima, now, no, nashi means to not exist. And put together, this is kind of a phrase scratch that. Nashi means to be without, to not exist. And what he said right now, forget about it. So,、uh, scratch that, forget about it. Ima no nashi. Ah, warui. Ima no nashi. Ah, ore sa. Shin ni chikazuki sugi de. Atama ga guru guru nan da yara. So he's trying to avoid this kind of uncomfortable situation that he had previously with Riku. And so he says, Ore sa, shin ni chikatsuki sugite. So, Ore sa, me, you know. Shin is this kind of bad guy that we saw previously, kind of a big whale. <laughs> ni is to sin, chikatsuku is to approach, but here it's connected to sugiru, to do too much. So, chikatsuki sugite, to approach too much, to sin. Atama ga guru guru nan da yo na. So, atama is your head, ga, so your head is doing something, and then guru guru is like to go around and around. So, kind of my head's all twisty and turvy, it's going around and around. Because he approached sin too much, his head's kind of messed up. Nanda, he's explaining, it is the case. Yo, he's teaching something, and then na, a bit of a masculine ne. So, look, I got too close to sin and my head's all messed up. Uh, ore sa, sin ni chikazuki sugi de, atama ga guru guru nan da yara. Da kara, どこから来たとか、ここがどこなのかとか。だから、どこから来たとか。So, だから、that's why、どこから、from where、来た、came とか、things like。So, things like where I came from、ここが、どこなのかとか。So, ここが、here is、どこ、where、なのか。Where it is, this place is, toka, things like. So things like where I came from and things like where this is. And he's kind of leading on to something like shiranai, to not know, or wakaranai, I don't understand. So I don't know things like where I'm from or where this is. Dokuke. We can see here there's a few different readings for this word. But if we have a look at the bottom right where the pitch accent is, we can see it's dokuke. And as we can see, it's a poisonous air, some sort of poisonous gas, or perhaps even just toxicity of something, or even the ill will. Ni yarareta means you were done in by something, and ni marks what you were done in by. And then ka, a question, like a huh. So, ugh,、oh, you were done in by sin's poisonous gas, huh? Shin no dokuke ni yarareta ka. でもこうして生きてるんだ。
。でも、こうして生きてるんだ。So, demo, however, こうして like this, 生きてる to be living in the explaining. However, you're living like this. でもこうして生きてるんだ。エボンの賜物だな。<laughs> And as they kind of continue on with their Dragon Ball esque type prayer here, he says, エボンの賜物だな。So, エボン is the name of something, no 賜物 This is a new word we can see here. This means the gift or the boon of something. Now, Ebon or Evon in Final Fantasy X is actually a kind of religion. 賜物 here is the boon of Evon. Dana, it's the case, huh? So he's kind of saying, oh, it was a gift from Evon that your life is saved. Ebon no 賜物だな。トレーニング続けてろ。So, toreningu is just training. Tsuzukeru is to continue something, and then it's in the imperative form. Tsuzukero. So, continue on with your training. Toreningu, tsuzukero. Ore wa wakka. Kono bisaido ora kano senshiken coach da. Hey, there we have his name. So, this is Waka. Ore wa wakka. So, my name's Waka. Kono bisaido ora kano senshiken coach da. So, kono this. Bisaido is be said in English. So, Bisaido Oraka, this is the name of his team, the Besed Oraks, I believe. So, Oraka no Senshu Ken Kochida. Senshu is the word for an athlete. Ken is a very interesting piece of language here because this is in replacement for the particle to. And. <laughs> so, an athlete, Senshu Ken. And Kochida, a coach. So he's an athlete for the Besed Oryx, at the same time, he's also the coach. <laughs> What noise was that, Titus? <laughs> so Waka's like,、uh, it looks like you're hungry. Nanda, Haraherika. So, nanda, what the hell? Haraheri is the same as haraheta, you're hungry, and then ka, huh? So, huh? You're hungry, huh? Nanda, haraheri ka? Eish, mura ik zo! Nanka k u a s h t e r Awesome, now we're finally about to have control back of the character, and so as Waka walks away, he says, Osh, mura ik zo! Nanka k u a s h t e r So, osh is like yosh, alright. Mura is a village. Iku, to go, and then zo, emphatic yo. So, alright, let's go to the village. Nanka, something, and then kuashite yaru. Ku is to eat. Kuasu is to give or to make someone eat something. Te yaru is to do for someone else. So, let's go to the village. I'll feed you something. Osh, mura ik zo! Nanka kuashite yaru! ワッカはいいやつだと思っただから聞いてみたくなったんだ。And Titus kind of shares his thoughts with us here and he says, ワッカはいいやつだと思った。So ワッカは、as for ワッカ、いいやつ is a good guy だと思った。That's what I thought. だから、that's why 聞いてみたくなったんだ。So, Kiku is to ask something. Kite mi tai, he wants to ask. Kite mi taku nata, he became wanting to ask. And then, nda, he's explaining. So, that's why it is that he became wanting to ask him something. Waka wa ii yatsu da to omotta. Dakara, kite mi taku natta nda. Ano sa, zanaru kando te, sen nen mai ni horobitan da yana. Ano sa, hey, look. Zanaru kando te. So we're talking about zanakand. Te is a replacement here for the wa particle, it's just a bit more casual. Sennen mae ni. So sennen is a thousand years. Mae is before. So a thousand years ago. Horobitan da yo na. Horobiru is to perish, to go to ruin, to be destroyed. And then nda is explanatory, yo na, right? So hey, look, you know, zanakand, it was destroyed a thousand years ago, huh? あのさ、ザナルカンドって千年前に滅びたんだよな。今は遺跡になってしまったでいいんだよな。今は遺跡になってしまった。Ima wa, as for now, iseki is an N1 piece of language we can see meaning some sort of ruin, particularly here talking about archaeological remains. So, iseki ni natte shimata, it became regretfully or completely. So, as for now, it's become completely a ruin. De, in da yo na. 
de is like with or as, so as what he just said, e to be good, nda is explaining, your na, right? So it is that, it's true that Zanakand has become ruins. Ah oh, man, I love the vibes of this episode so much already. It's so much more colorful now. So, mukashi mukashi, long time ago. Supira ni wa, so as for in Spira. Dekkai means huge. Machi, a town, ga taksan atta. So, taksan, many, atta, existed. So, long, long ago, in Spira, there were many huge towns. Mukashi mukashi, Spira ni wa dekkai machi ga taksan atta. Yoru is night, demo, even in night. Nigiakana, so nigiaka means to be lively, vibrant, and it's modifying the next thing that comes because we can see it's na adjective. So nigiakana kikai jikake. And we can see this means mechanism, mechanical parts. So a mechanical dai toshi. Dai means huge and toshi is for a city. Put it together, a large city. Dai toshi or a metropolis. So long ago there were many huge cities in Spira. Huge mechanical metropolises that were lively even at night. Minna kikai no chikara ni tayotte. Minna, everyone, kikai, machines, no chikara, the power of machines, ni tayotte. Tayoru is to rely on, so everyone relied on the power of machines. Omoshiro okashiku asonde ta wakeda. This is an interesting expression here, omoshiro okashi. This means humorous, funny, amusing, hilarious. Asobu is to play, so asondeta, they played, and then wakeda. He's stating some sort of conclusion or reason or perhaps even a cause for something, or even just the situation. He's explaining that it is that they all relied on the power of machines and they lived a very perhaps frivolous life. <laughs> Have a look. Ah oh, man, the vibes of Final Fantasy X. I just love the atmospheres in this game. It's so good. I can definitely see how this game still lives up to the test of time as like people often consider one of the best Final Fantasies or even one of the best JRPGs. So here looking out at this beautiful view with some ruins, Waka says, Totsuzen, Shin ga arawarete. So Totsuzen is all of a sudden, Shin ga, so Sin did something. Arawarete is to appear, so Sin appeared all of a sudden. Kikai no machi, the mechanical towns, o, so doing something to those towns. Zembu, all of them, koashi chimatta, completely destroyed. So all of a sudden, Sin appeared and he completely destroyed all of the mechanical towns. Totsuzen Shin ga arawarete. Kikai no machi o zembu koashi chimatta. Mochiron, zanaru kando mo na. Mochiron, zanaru kando mo na. Mochiron, of course, zanaru kando, zanakund mo, also na, the masculine ne. Now, I'm just trying to think, was zanakund really all that mechanical? I kind of remember that really big kind of door. Yeah, that was pretty mechanical, wasn't it? The kind of the big gate that opened up. And there must have been some sort of machinery going on in order to keep that big sphere ball for Blitzball. So yeah, I suppose it was a bit of a mechanical city. <laughs> I believe here he's actually more just broadly referring to technology. There was clearly a lot of technology in Zanakand, whereas now that kind of technology is gone. Sorega daitai sennen mae. So sorega, as for that, daitai is like roughly sennen mae a thousand years ago. So that was about a thousand years ago. So, omae no iu tori da. So, that's right, omae no iu tori. Iu tori is as said, and then omae no, so yours, so as you said. Omae no iu tori da. It's just as you said. Sorega daitai sennen mae. So. And he have a very interesting interpretation of the events that happened. So Waka says, Ma, well, Shin wa, as for Sin, Choshi ni notte shimatta ningei no batsu te wakeda. 
So Choshi ni Noru is to get carried away, as we just saw kind of living a frivolous life, just having a lot of parties and having fun. Ningen is humans, E is two, not the possessive particle, Batsu, punishment. So the punishment to the people who got carried away and kind of lived way too much of a frivolous life. Te wakedana. That's how it is, huh? Well, I guess sin is punishment for those living a frivolous life. Ma, sin wa choshi no chimatta ningen ye no batsu te wakedana. Mataku yo. Mataku yo. So mataku, jeez. And here he's almost kind of complaining. He's like, ah, oh, come on. Mataku yo. So, Mukashi, long ago, no Yatsura, those guys, no Seide. This is for the fault of something. So, because of, usually a negative thing, because of those guys long ago, Ima no ore tachi ga. So the us of now, kuro suru nante, and kuro suru is to have some sort of trouble or hardship, nante, such a thing as. So such a thing as us having a hard time because of those guys from the past. Hara ga tatsu yo na. Hara we saw previously with hara heri to be hungry, but here hara your stomach ga tatsu to stand up. This actually means he gets angry. Hara ga tatsu. So hara ga tatsu yo na. Really pisses me off. Why are we suffering from the mistakes of the people in the past? And then he continues on with Mochiron So of course, Tsumi we know is some sort of sin or punishment. Otsugunao to make up for, to compensate for something. Or very fitting for a sin, Tsumi is to atone for. So to atone for your sins. Tsumi wo tsugunao. And then no wa, the thing of. So as for the thing of atoning for your sins, of course, ima no ningen no taisetsu na yakume da. Now, ima no ningen, the people of now, taisetsu na is a na adjective for precious or important, and it's modifying yakume. And this is one's duty. So an important duty. Taisetsu na yakume da. So of course, the thing of atoning for your sins is nowadays people's important duty. Or perhaps it's the important duty of people today to atone for their sins. So, Sorya, Sore wa, as for that, Wakateru, I understand, Sa, you know. Hmm, yeah. Demo, however, toki doki, sometimes, yari kire nakunatte na. And we can see this comes from the expression yari kire nai, to either be unable to finish something or for something to be unbearable. It's too much. And that's very much the use here, definition number two. Sometimes it's just too much. Toki doki, yari kire nai. However, here it's yari kire nakunatte. So it becomes unable to bear. Nah, right. So Ryuku is Riku. Itta tori we already know means as they said, and then data it was. So it was just as Ryuku said. Ryuku mo. So both waka and riku, uso tsuku hitsuyo nante. So uso tsuku is to tell a lie, hitsuyo, the need, nante, such as, so such as the need to lie. Uso tsuku hitsuyo nante. Zenzen nainda. Zenzen means not at all, nai to not exist. So zenzen nai would be absolutely not. And then nda explaining. So both waka and riku have absolutely no need to lie. So he's starting to accept the reality that Zanakand is long gone. <laughs> okay, there's a little bit of odd lip syncing there. So here Waka laughs and he says, Demo yo, however you know. Zanaru kando ebsu te no wa waraeta zo. So the te no wa means the thing of, and he's quoting something. So to say or to mention, the Zanakand abes waraeta. 
I was able to laugh. So this is kind of like, it makes me laugh. So, <laughs> but you know, the Zanuck and Abes, oh, you made me laugh, you know. <laughs> if or perhaps, Sonna team, a team like that, Hontoni, truly, Atta, to have existed, no Kamoshire Nai Kedo. And Kamoshire Nai is perhaps. And Kedo, however. So if by chance, perhaps there really was a team like that that existed. まあ、まあ、楽して暮らしてた時代のチームなんて言わっちに決まってるけどね。まあ、well、楽して暮らしてた時代のチームなんて。So, 楽 is for something to be comfort or ease, for it to be easy going. So, 楽して, to have an easy life, 暮らしてた, to have lived, 時代 is an error, so the error of being able to live without any hardships, no chimu, so a team from the era where you can live without any hardships, none there's such a thing as that. Yowachi ni kimatteru kedo na. And yowachi here is another way of saying yowai, weak. Yowachi ni kimatteru means it's decided, or it's almost like fixed. So it's definitely the case that a team that would have lived in such a easy to live circumstances would definitely be weak. Nah. <laughs> and he tries to console Titus and he says, So, Omaega, you doing an action, Ochikomu here is to kind of get depressed, to fall down, to feel down. So, you're kind of falling into depression. Ochikomu koto nai means there's no need to do it. Daroga. And daroga is the same as deshoga. And it's kind of like a strong way of saying daro, isn't it? Right? But when this ga is added at the end, it almost has this feeling of kind of criticizing or pressing the person it's directed to. It just makes it a little bit more of a stronger emphasis. So, this is nothing for you to get depressed about, right? <laughs> So, ore o, doing something to me, hagemashite kureru. This is an N1 piece of language to encourage someone, hagemasu. So, hagemashite kureru means you did it for me, you encouraged for me, you tried to cheer me up. Waka, so the waka who was trying to cheer me up, no kimochi, his feelings, ureshikatta, I was glad. So, however, I was glad for waka's feelings of wanting to try and encourage me and cheer me up. でもその時、俺が考えていたのは始まりは死んだ。でも、however、その時、that that's why もう一度, one more time shin ni to sin aeba if i could meet sin so however if i could meet sin one more time だからもう一度シンに会えばそれができたらザナルカンドへ帰ることができるかもしれない if I'm able to do that, zanarukando e to zanakand kaeru koto ga dekiru kamo shirenai. So, kaeru to return home, koto ga dekiru to be able to do kamo shirenai. I may be able to do it. So, if I'm able to meet sin one more time, perhaps I'll be able to return to zanakand. So, if I'm able to meet sin one more time, perhaps I'll be able to return to zanakand. So, if I'm able to meet sin one more time, perhaps I'll be able to return to zanakand. So, if I'm able to meet Ah, the beautiful beach. I myself just moved to Fukuoka and I see this kind of beach side quite often now and it's just absolutely wonderful. I love the beach so much. Something I've really missed since moving to Japan. I lived in Kyoto ever since I moved to Japan, so I've been just in the mountains the entire time. So it's so nice to finally be able to see the beach just like this. This is a very, very fitting episode, I think. And here's a PSA. If you've never been to Fukuoka, you should definitely, definitely go. In my opinion, one of the nicest places of all of Japan with some of the most delicious food and very, very nice people. A really wonderful place. Anyway, sono toki ga kurumade wa, so as for until that time comes, koko ga doko ka to ka, so koko ga here, doko ka, where, to ka, things like, so 
things like where this is. It's no jidai da to ka. Things like what era this is. Kini suru no wa yame yo. And kini suru here is to worry about something, to have something on your mind. No wa, the thing of doing that, yame yo. Let's stop. So if you put all of this together, until that time comes, where this is and what time this is, let's not worry about it. その時が来るまではここがどこかとかいつの時代だとか気にするのはやめよう気にしないってのは難しかったけど少しだけ楽になった気にしないってのは難しかったけど少しだけ楽になった So, 気にしない to not worry about something てのは the thing of that 難しかった it was difficult けど however 少しだけ just a little bit 楽になった it became a bit easier for me So it was difficult to not worry about things. However, deciding not to worry so much did make things a little bit easier. 気にしないってのは難しかったけど、少しだけ楽になった。ほんの少しだけ。ほんの少しだけ。So ほんの is like a mere, just very little, just, and then 少しだけ。Only a little. So just a very, very little bit. ほんの少しだけ。ほんの少しだけ。Ah, I love the vibes of Pesed. It's so nice. The music's great. The vibes are great. It's so beautiful. So, as we're following Waka, he says, Oi, Kochida. Oi is like, Hey, Kochida, over here. So, hey, over here. Oi, Kochida. Nanka, <laughs> Nanka. And as Waka kind of suspiciously steps back a little bit,、uh, Titus is looking over the edge and he says, Nanka. An no ka? So, nanka, something. An is kind of casual for aru to exist, and then no ka, a question. So, is something there? Nanka, an no ka? Nani s u n d a y o And at that moment, I would have died <laughs> because I can't swim. <laughs> Unfortunately,、uh, as much as I love the water, I'm an Australian who's used to dry places in the mountainside. Nani sundayo! A very appropriate thing to say if someone happens to push you off a cliff. <laughs> Nani sundayo? Nani what? Sun is sudu, and then dayo, he's kind of exclaiming something. So, what the hell? Nani sundayo? Nani sundayo? <laughs> Man, Waka's a bit of a dick. <laughs> so he grabs Titus in the water and Titus screams out, Hanase yo! So Hanasu is to release to let something go. And he has it in the imperative form, Hanase. So let me go! Hanase yo! Onegai ga arundana! So, onegai is some sort of request. Ga aru, I have dana desne, you know. So, I've got a request, you know? Certainly an interesting way of making a request pushing someone off a cliff and strangling them in the water. <laughs> oh, and Titus is very quick. He says, Anta no chimu ni haire ten daro. So, Anta no chimu, your team, ni to your team, haire. Join Tendaro. That's what it is, right? So you want me to join your team, right? Anta no team ni hire tendaro? More soon, Okina Pritz no Taikangari. Spiraju no team at Mar Tekayasa. More soon, very soon. Okina Britz no Taikai ga aru. So Okina means very large. Britz no Taikai. Taikai is like a tournament or competition. And it's a blitz ball competition. Britz no Taikai ga aru. There is one. So very soon there's going to be a really big blitz ball competition. Spira ju, that means throughout Spira. No chimu ga, the teams throughout Spira do something. Atsumaru. And that's to gather together. Dekai yatsuda. 
the guy we know is huge, Yatsu or one. So he's saying this is a really big one where people from all over Spira are going to be gathering. Oh, and he's kind of thinking of Titus here because he says, Dekai Taikai Dakara, because it's a big competition. Omae no koto, about you. Shiteru yatsura mo, also someone who knows you. Kito kuru. And kito means surely, kuru is to come. So someone will surely come that knows you because it's a really big tournament. Dekai Taikai Dakara. お前のこと知ってる奴らもきっと来る。そしたらお前元のチームや生活に戻れるだろう。そしたらお前元のチームや生活に戻れるだろう。そうそしたら if it's the case or and then so he referring to going to the blitzball tournament and meeting people and if you meet someone そしたらお前 you moto is ex or previous chimu is team so your previous team ya things like seikatsu your life ni modoreru to be able to return back to those things daro right so if you do that you'll be able to return to your old team and your previous life right soしたら omae moto no chimu ya seikatsu ni modoreru daro na warui hanashi ja nai to omou zo dou da na ah so beautiful. I know it's a PS2 game and I know it's a little bit modded, but oh, so beautiful. Nah, hey, warui hanashi janai to omozo. So warui bad hanashi, a talk janai to not be to omo, I think, and then zo being emphatic. So hey, it's not a bad conversation, right? Doda, how about it? Nah, hey. Nah, warui hanashi janai to omozo. Doda, nah. Ah. E yo. So E is okay, and then yo, he's kind of teaching him or telling him something. So it's okay, sure. E yo. Arigato yo. Taikai made tarondaku. These kind of characters are great. These kind of strong, manly characters are a little bit dopey, like Barrett and stuff, right? Great character to have. So, arigato yo! Thank you so much. Taikai made until the tournament. Tanondaze, I'm counting on you. Arigato yo! Taikai made tanondaze! Blitz to Shin dake ga Zanaru Kando to Spira o tsunai deru yona kiga shitan da. And then Titus continues to think to himself and he says, Buritsu to Shin dake ga. So, Buritsu to Blitz and Sin dake only. And then, ga Zanaru Kando to Spira o. So, with Zanakand and Spira. And then we're doing something to those locations. Tsunagu is to connect. So, here, Tsunai deiru is to be connected. Yona, like. And then Kiga Suru is to have a feeling. So I have a feeling that only Blitz and Sin is connecting Zanakand and Spira together. Blitz to Sin dake ga Zanaru Kando to Spira o tsunai deru yona kiga shitan da. Sonna ni hazurete na katta ro? Sonna ni hazurete na katta ro? So sonna ni so much or like that. And then hazureru here is definition number two, to miss the mark, to be wrong. So the opposite of this, when you guess something correctly, would be atari. But here, to miss the mark, to not guess correctly, hazureru. And you normally see this verb meaning to disconnect from something, to get out of place, or to kind of be off. And here it's kind of to be off the mark, hazureru. Hazurete nakata wasn't disconnected. And then we see this verb in the past tense form followed by ro. And this is the same thing as daro or desho. It's just a bit more casual way of saying it. So, hazurete nakata desho, hazurete nakata daro, hazurete nakata ro. You can see how it could naturally contract like this in more casual speech. So, I didn't miss the mark that much, right? Okay, so we've now made it to the top of the mountain and we can see overlooking Besaide Village. And Waka kind of points over there and he says, Ore wa asoko de. So as for me, over there, umarete, I was born. 
Gosai de. Gosai is five years old, and then de is at the age. It's kind of a marker of time. So when I was five years old, Blitzboru o. So doing something to Blitzball, hajimeta. I began it. So Waka is saying that he was born in that town over there, and he started Blitzball when he was five years old. And then he continues with So when he was 13 years old, So he joined the Besed Oryx. Haidu here was to enter to join something, so here entering into the team. And it's in the Te form, so it's continuing on. So kind of like, at 13, I joined the Besed Oryx, and then... And then he finishes off with Junen Senshu Te Yatsu Dana. Junen, 10 years time. Senshu, we know means an athlete. Te Yatsu is Toyu Yatsu. So at 13 years old, I joined the Besed Oryx, and I've been an athlete for 10 years. でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、でも、で
ikkai is the counter for one time, sen here is for a match or a battle, so the first round, the first match of last year, chansu datta, it was a chance. So in last year's first round, there was a chance to win. Ah, and all of a sudden he starts to get a little bit more serious in his tone and he says, Demo, kitsui koto ga atte, shiai ni shuchu deki nakata. So, demo, however, kitsui means kind of tough, difficult, koto, a thing ga atte. There was or I had, so I had something difficult happen. Shiai ni, shiai is the match, ni is into, so into the match. Shuchu deki nakata. Now, shuchu sudu here is an N3 piece of language to mean to concentrate on something. So, whenever you're kind of concentrating on your study, for example, this is the word you would use. Shuchu sudu. But here, shuchu deki nakata. He was unable to focus because something kitsui happened. Demo, kitsui koto ga atte, shiai ni shuchu deki nakata. Iiwake s ne. <laughs> Without knowing anything about the situation, Titus just pokes at it and he says, Iwake sne. Now, Iwake just means an excuse. Literally, if you were to break it down, I means good and wake is reasoning, a good reasoning, an excuse. You can see how it's kind of related. But just think of this as one word. This is the word for an excuse. Iwake. And then su here is slang for des. If you want to learn more about this, check out my des video as I cover that a little bit. But this is just a bit more of like a casual, polite way of saying des. If he says des, he's being a bit too formal here. He wants to still be friendly, but also still be a little bit polite. So this is almost like a casual des. Iwake sne. That's an excuse, huh? Iwake sne. Kibishi sne. <laughs> and Waka replies with the same use of su. Here he says, kibishi sne. Now, kibishi here means it's strict, severe. So Titus is strict for saying that that's all just an excuse. And then again, su ne, des ne. Now, I would say Waka is very typical of a character to actually use this su language. Maybe Titus as well. But I often see characters like Waka, Wedge from Final Fantasy VII Remake, and characters like that use this su. They're being polite and friendly. However, it might be a little bit too casual if you're going to use it with some complete strangers. It depends on the person. And then Titus continues on with so, tsugi no taikai. Tsugi just means the next. So, the next taikai, the next tournament. De at the next tournament. Katte to win at the next tournament. And then, sukkiri shitai. And sukkiri suru here means to just completely relieve yourself of something. A very common piece of language here, as you can see in the top 5,000. And it's kind of with a feeling of relief getting something off of your shoulder. Ah, sukkiri suru. You feel really relieved. Sukkiri shitai means you want to get it off your shoulder. So you kotoka, is that how it is? So you want to win at the next tournament and finally get all of that weight off your shoulder. Is that how it is? And Waka doesn't say anything, he just gives a silent nod. And so Titus replies with Taikai no mokyo wa? So the only new piece of language we have here is mokyo. And this is a very common N3 piece of language that means the goal or the target of something. Taikai no mokuhyo, the target of the tournament. So, what's the objective of the tournament? Taikai no mokuhyo wa? Junyi wa kanke nai nda. Ii shiai ga dekita ra sore de ii. Oh, we have a new piece of language here. Junyi. So, jun is like the order of something, and then ii is the placement, like first, second, third, fourth. Put it together, and it's the placement here in a race, or a placement in like a competition, the rank. Junyi wa, so as for the rank, kanke nainda. Kanke is to have relation to something, kanke nai means it's no concern, it's, there's no relation, and then nda is explaining. So I'm not concerned with the rank. And then he continues on with, i shiai ga dekitara, sore de i. Now, i shiai, a good match ga dekitara, if he's able to do, sore de, with that i, it's okay. So I don't care about how we rank, as long as we have a good match, I'm happy. Honkide yatta te jujitsu kan ga areba, 
Honki de means seriously with all earnest. Yatta te. So yatta to have done. Te is now defining what kind of jujitsukan, a sense of fulfillment or accomplishment. Ga areba. If I have. So as long as I have this feeling of fulfillment that I did my best. Ore sukiri yamerare ru to mo. So ore me sukiri getting that relief, getting that weight off his shoulders. Yamerareru, he's able to quit, tomo, I think. So I think as long as I have a good match and I feel like I gave it my all, I will be able to quit with a feeling of relief. <laughs> I like this side of Titus' personality, it's very cool. Kind of reminds me a little bit of One Piece, where he's like, he's very pure. He's not focused on other people's worries and stuff, and he's just focusing on the positives, right? So here, 目標を手聞かれたら So, 聞かれたら, when you're asked, and then te is now defining what you're asked. When you're asked, what is the objective? Yushou! And yushou here means a victory, like in a match, very, very commonly seen used in sports. Te is now defining how he should kotaero. And kotaero is the imperative form of kotaero to answer. So he's telling him, when you're asked what the objective is, you should answer with victory! But he is a little bit kibishi, he is a little bit strict. Here he says, So, deru is to appear to kind of come out. So, to go out into a match, nara, if it's the case, katsu, to win, sore igai, except for that, nani, what, ga arunda. What is it that exists? So when you go out to a match, what else is there but victory? What else is important? When you have a match, all that should matter is winning. <laughs> Waka's a little bit surprised by that and he says, Yusho maji ska. So Yusho victory? Maji, seriously, ska is the same as deska. Victory? Are you serious? You sure? Majiska? Oh! Umi gotta get to go! Okay, so now we're going to head down into the hill and head into Besed village. And as we make our way down, we get interrupted by this guy with uh, very bright hair and interesting pants. And here he says, Oh, umi kara kita hito ga. So, oh, is hey. Umi kara, from the sea, kita came hito person ka. Huh. So, huh, you're the person who came from the sea. Oh, umi kara kita hito ga. Kono michi wa mamono ga oi kara, chui shita ho ga ii yo. Here's some very important Final Fantasy language here. So, kono michi wa, as for this path, so when you're going down a path, michi, very common way, mamono is a monster, a magical being, if you look at it literally. This is very, 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 very common. An absolutely essential RPG term right here. Even that first kanji, it looks very difficult, but make sure you get very familiar with it. This is magic. Same thing with maho, magic, mamono, monsters. Very important. So, mamono ga oi kara, because there's a lot of monsters on this path, chui shita ho ga ii yo, chui suru here is to be careful, shita ho ga ii, it's better if you did it. And then yo, he's teaching him something. So, because there's a lot of monsters on this path, you'd better be careful. Kono michi wa mamono ga oi kara, chui shita ho ga ii yo. Shin ni chikazui ta no ni tasukatta n daro, honna tokoro de yarareru na yo. Now we know a lot of this language. To have approached to sin. No ni, despite. Taskata, you were saved. Ndaro, right? So it is that you were saved. Despite getting close to sin. Konna tokoro de. In a place like this. Yarareru na yo. Don't be done in. So despite the fact that you approached sin and you were saved, don't be done in in a place like this. <laughs> I 
<laughs> exactly. Who? <laughs> Dare. So Dare who? So these guys just randomly appear and tell us off for, for hanging around this area and then disappear. Dare who? Dare. Tobatsutaino Rutsuto Gatta. Ah, now this is a very tricky expression here to translate it into English. So Waka says Tobatsutaino Rutsuto Gatta. Now, Tōbatsu is a piece of language that we've actually come across in Final Fantasy VII Remake. I think when it was Chapter 3, when you go out and try and kill all the monsters, and there's like a count of how many monsters you kill, it's actually a Tōbatsu quest. And we can see here that Tōbatsu means to subjugate, to suppress. And it means to kind of quell the numbers of something, like to kill monsters, to suppress those numbers. I even believe I've seen it in Near Replicant when you have to kill all the monsters to keep them out of the village. Tai is a unit, like a military unit or a group. So Torbats Tai, you could look at it as kind of like a suppression group, but that's very unnatural English. There could even be translations like commandos, but that seems really weird. And so here for the English version in the localization, they call these guys the Crusaders. And you can see there is a kind of similar DNA here. A suppression squad are a bunch of people who go to quell the numbers of something evil and kind of keep them down and keep everyone else safe. And that's kind of an image that the Crusaders can have, although certainly not all the time in historical situations, but it does, I guess they're supposed to have that kind of feeling. So Tōbatsutai, the suppression squad, no Lutsu to Gata. So that's Lutz and Gata from the Tōbatsutai, the suppression squad. Tōbatsutai? Oh, and that's very interesting. So here, Titus actually doesn't understand what that word means. And we can see that here because he's saying it in katakana. This is often used when you're talking about something foreign. And here, Titus is actually expressing that this word is foreign to him. That's why he says it in katakana. It's not always used this way, but it is being used in this situation. There's no way he could say this word with kanji in it because he doesn't even know what it means. And this often happens with things like when children talk. You might see them talking in hiragana or katakana, not kanji, because if a character's not supposed to know the kanji, perhaps because of intellectual reasons or just not knowing, that very fact is expressed by them not using kanji when they talk. And you could almost see this as a little bit discriminatory sometimes in Japanese TV when they have foreigners speaking Japanese and they give them katakana even though they sound very, very clear. Because it has this feeling of it's not quite 100% understanding. It's something foreign. So, hmm? Huh? What's a tōbatsutai? Huh? Tōbatsutai? Omae. Even that thing, you've forgotten it, no ka? A question. So you, you've even forgotten that? Ah, that's nice. Thanks, Waka. So he says, Warukata. It was my bad. Kinisunna. Don't worry about it. Orega. I'm the one that will. Mendo mite aru. And mendo here we can see meaning trouble, bother, care, or attention. Mite yaru. Miru is to look. Te yaru means I'll do for you. So I will look after you. So mendo miru is to look after someone. So don't worry about it. I'll take care of you. Warukata. <laughs> and us is kind of like a very casual way of saying, got it. Sono kawari. So in exchange for that. Taikai no toki wa. So as for at the time of the tournament. Dai katsuyaku shite yaru kara. And dai katsuyaku here means to be very active, to play a very strong role in something. Here, to be very useful. To be very useful in the tournament. Shite yaru, I'll do for you, kara because. So, to kind of show appreciation for you taking care of me now, I'll put my all in the match to help you win. Sono kawari, taikai no toki wa dai katsuyaku shite yaru kara. This. This. Alright. This. Ah, tobasutai no koto wa chokusetsu kike yo. And here Waka gives us a suggestion if we want to know more about these Tōbatsutai. Tōbatsutai no koto wa, so as for about the Tōbatsutai, chokusetsu kike yo. Now chokusetsu means doing something directly, kike is the imperative form of kiku, to listen, and then yo, he's teaching him something, he's telling him to do something. So if you want to know about the Crusaders, ask them directly. Mura no shukusha ni iru hazuda. 
So mura, the village, no shukusha. This means the accommodation, like a hotel, like the lodging. Think of it kind of like the inn. Shukusha ni iru, to be in that inn. Hazu, expecting to be the case. And then da, stating it to be. So they should be in the inn in the village. So if you want to know more about them, make sure to ask them directly. Ah, tobase no kota, chokset kikyo. Mura no shukusha ni iru hazu da. Man, this area has some of my favorite music from Final Fantasy X. Just really chill, nice vibes. So we've arrived at Bisaid Village. Bisaido Murada. It's Bisaid Village. Bisaido Murada. Tabemono. Aru? Yes, okay, he has very much a Luffy type personality here, so very Goku ish. All he thinks about is positivity and food. <laughs> so the first thing he says when he arrives in town is Tabemono. Aru. So tabemono is food, aru to exist. So do you got any food? Tabemono. Aru? Ato de ano ye de kuwasete yaru. Shibaraku hima tsubushite ro. Ato de afterwards, ano ye de in that house kuwasete yaru. I'll feed you. Shibaraku for the time being. Hima tsubushite ro. Now hima is free time, tsubusu is to crush, so to kill time, and then shite ro, telling him to do it. So I'll feed you in that house later on, but for now, I'll kill some time. So da na. So so da na, that's right. So da na. Ah, so ko ga tobas tai shikusha da. So Asoko over there, so he's pointing over there to the tent. Tobatsutai Shukusha, we know means the subjugation squad's in or lodging. Da to be. Lutsu to gata ni. So two lutz and gata. Iroiro means various things. Kite miru is to try asking. So over there is the Tobatsutai's lodging. Make sure to ask lutz and gata a lot of things. Asoko ga Tobatsutai Shukusha da. Ah, yes, I remember. So, so. Kochikoi! Kochikoi! <laughs> so, Kochi over here, Koi come. So, come over here. Kochikoi! No, 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 Think of this very much as a set expression here, meaning whatever the circumstances may be. No matter how you look at it, say whatever you want. So no matter the situation that you're in, oinori wa oinori is prayer, oinori wa as for the prayer, oboeteru yo na. You remember it, right? Omae. And here I can say, Ya, wasureta. No, I forgot it. Or, Sonna no, shiranai. I don't know about that. I think I'll just say, Ya, wasureta. I forgot it. Wasureta te yuka, shiranakatta n dakedo sa. Ah, but Titus doesn't quite agree with my choice because here he says, Wasureta te yuka. So rather than the fact that he forgot it, it's actually that I didn't know it. So your life, this is kind of like daily life, and then no. Kihon, this means the foundations, the basis. Daro, right? So this is the basics for general life, right? Ma, tonikaku, oshiete yaru. Mm. So, ma, well, anyway. Tonikaku, at any rate, oshiete yaru, I will teach you. Mm. Yes. Seikatsu no kihon daro? Ma, tonikaku, oshiete yaru. Yatemi? So very casual expressions we're having here, so hore, look, or come on. Yatemi, give it a shot. So now he wants us to try and do that weird Dragon Ball pose. Hore, <laughs> yatemi? Oh, oh. Oh, oh. 
上出来だ。よし、上出来だ。そう、よし、all right。上出来 is a new piece of language here. This means a good performance, a great work. だ、to be。So he's like, awesome, great job. よし、上出来だ。じゃあ、ジーンの召喚師様にご挨拶してきな。じゃあ、ジーンの召喚師様にご挨拶してきな。So, じゃあ、well then, ジーン、here's a new piece of language at the end too. This means some sort of temple, perhaps some sort of church, or some sort of religious building. And we can actually see it just a little bit in the back there. ジーンの召喚師様。召喚 is the word for summon in Japanese. So if you know what the summons are, that's your kind of beast that you can call down to help you in battle. 召喚 is the word for that in Japanese. 召喚師 that means a summoner. 師 is often used for like a master of something, so a summoner. Summer is now being honorific to that person. Ni to. So, to the summoner of this temple. Go aisatsu. This means to greet. Go aisatsu shite kina. This means come to greet them. So, well, then make sure to come greet the temple summoner. Ja, Jin no Shokan Sama ni go aisatsu shite kina. So, it was. Blitzball no Senshu da tara. Dare demo shite ru shori no majinai da tara. Ooh, interesting. We see a little bit of the worlds colliding here. So, Titus is very confused with their weird ritual here because. So, it was. That is. Blitzball no. The Blitzballs. If it's the case that you're an athlete for Blitzball, Dare demo, anyone, Shiteru, to know, Shori, victory, no omajinai datta. And omajinai here is a good luck charm. Datta was. So he's very confused because anyone who was an athlete for Blitzball would know that this was a good luck charm for Blitzball. It's literally a ball. So it was. Blitzball no senshu datta ra. それ最近か Okay, and for the last scene in this episode, I'm gonna go check out this inn and see what these Torbatsutai guys have to say. So, Gata, he says, Na, Anta, Shin ni osoware tan da ro? So, hey, you, Anta, Shin ni, by sin, osoware ta, were attacked. Da ro, right? Sore, that. Saikin ka? Is that recent? Na, Anta, Shin ni osoware tan da ro? Sore, saikin ka? Tabu na. Tabu na. Probably. So, ja, well then, shima no chikaku ni, nearby the island, shin ga iru, so sin is somewhere nearby, no ka, questioning. So, is it that sin's nearby the island? Ja, shima no chikaku ni, shin ga iru no ka, kaku shite nai yo na. Kaku shite nai yo na. You're not hiding it, right? もちろんもちろん of course もちろんこの近くにシンが来たのなら島を襲いに来るはずだこの近くにシンが来たのならこの近くに nearby here シンが来たのなら if it's the case that シン came 島を so doing something to the island 襲いに来るはずだ so 襲う is to attack 襲いに来る is to come to attack Hazuda is expected to be the case. So if Sin was nearby, it's expected to be the case that he would come attack this island. So, Tokoroga, even so, Sonna, like that, Kehai, the indication, the sign, the hint, the feeling, wa nai. It doesn't exist. So, kehai is very, very common that you see used for some sort of presence, to feel the presence of something. Kehai wa nai means that there is no presence, there's no feeling of sin being around here. Tokoro ga, sonna kehai wa nai. Warui kedo, ore ni wa nani mo wakara nai yo. Warui kedo, ore ni wa nani mo wakara nai yo. So, warui kedo, I'm sorry, however, ore ni wa, as for in me, nani mo, nothing, wakara nai yo, I don't know. So I'm sorry, but I don't know anything. 
俺討伐隊ってのもなんだかよく分かってない。大体、generally or in the first place。俺、み、討伐隊ってのも、so also the thing of the 討伐隊、なんだかよくわかってない。So I don't even know what you guys are. 大体、俺、討伐隊ってのも、なんだかよくわかってない。冗談だろ冗談だろ冗談 is a joke だろ right? So you're kidding, right? 冗談だろ真の毒気か。Oh, a bit of revision. Shin no dokuke ka. So, shin no dokuke, the poisonous gas or even the evil will of sin. Shin no dokuke ka. Gata, hanashte yare. Gata, hanashte yare. So, gata, tell him about it. Gata, hanashte yare. Hi, senpai. Hi, senpai. Hi, yes, senpai is kind of like senior. So, yes, senpai. Hi, senpai. Okay, now we have a bit of an explanation of what the Tobats Tai is. Tobats Tai wa Shin to Tatakao Tame ni. So, to with Sin Tatakao to fight Tame ni for the sake of Umareta was born Soshiki Dearu. And Soshiki is like an organization, Dearu is just like des or da to be. But he's stating it in a bit more of like a formal way. So, The Crusaders are an organization formed to fight against sin. Spiraduni Shibuga Ari. So, Spiradu throughout Spira. Shibu, this is a new piece of language. This means a branch or a subdivision. Ga Ari, they exist. And it's Ari instead of Atte, because he's speaking in a bit more formal way. But it's the same meaning here. So, there are branches all throughout Spira. Soko ni shigan shita mono wa. So, soko ni there. Shigan suru here means to volunteer, to apply to something. Shigan shita mono wa. So, as for people applying or volunteering, dare demo, anyone, sanka kano dearu. Sanka is to participate, kano means it's possible, and then dearu, stating to be in a formal way. So, anyone's welcome to apply to be a volunteer. スピラ中に支部があり、そこに志願した者は誰でも参加可能である。討伐隊は800年前に英雄ミヘン様が作った石山州を起源とする。Oh, we have some more difficult language here. So, 討伐隊は800年前に、So, as for the 討伐隊、800 years ago、英雄ミヘン様が作った。So, a few pieces of tricky language here. So, AU here is for a hero, very, very common word. For example, the hero Sephiroth, this was the same word used in Final Fantasy VII, AU Sephiroth. Here, AU Mihen, so the hero Mihen, Sama, an honorific suffix put at the end of his name to make him more respectful, ga tsukutta, so he's the one who made something. And then we have Sekizan Shu. This is a very tricky word to look up. Seki means red or kind of crimson. Zan could be like decapitating, cutting something off. And then Shu is like a group. So you could almost look at it as like the red decapitating group. <laughs> However, the English translation has gone for a little bit more of a neutral crimson blades, so definitely a little bit less dark. So the crimson blades are what he made, or kigen to suru. And kigen means the origin of something. So using the crimson blades as the origin for the Tōbatsu Tai. Tōbatsu Tai wa 800 nen mai ni Eiyu Mihen sama ga tsukutta Sekizan Shu o kigen to suru. Kōnen soshiki o kakudai shi Tōbatsu Tai to nao kae, ilai. Shin to tatakai tsukete iru no dearu. Konen, in the later years, Soshiki o kakudai shi. So, Soshiki, the organization, kakudai suru is to expand. Shi again is shite, but he's speaking formally, but it's functioning in the same way as the te form. So, in later years, the organization expanded. Tobats tai to nao kae. So, Tobats tai, the subjugation group, to nao kae. They changed their name too. So, to is marking exactly what they changed their name to. So, the Sekizan Shu, or the Crimson Blades, changed their name into the Tobats tai, the Crusaders. Irai. Since then, Shin to with Sin tatakai tsuzukete iru no de aru. So, tatakai tsuzukeru is to continue fighting, and then no de aru is the same as no des, but he's speaking formally. So, ever since then, we've been fighting against Sin. Konen soshiki o kakudai shi, Tobats tai to nao kae, ilai, Shin to tatakai tsuzukete iru no de aru. 800 nen mo tatakai tsuzukete, Shin o taose nai no ka? 
<laughs> Very good question, Titus. <laughs> so Titus says, nen mo To continue fighting for 800 years? Shin o taosenai no ka? Can't you defeat sin? So tao seru is to be able to defeat something, defeating sin. So you've been fighting for 800 years. Are you guys not able to defeat sin? He's a little bit taken back by that, so Lutsu takes over here and he says, So as for what the subjugation squad is able to do, Shinno Shinro. Shinro is just the root of something, the path, the course. Shinro Kae Sasetari. Kae Saseru is to make someone change, so to make Sin change his root, and then Tari is things like. So all that the Tobatsutai is able to do is do things like change the root of Sin. So they can't stop him, they just change where he goes. <laughs> it's like a force of nature, you know, you can't stop nature. Tobatsutai <laughs> Ma So ma well then hakiri to be kind of clear, open, honest, ite to say to so to speak honestly or to speak openly. Sono It's around that amount. So that's pretty much all we can do if I was to speak honestly. So tabun. Probably, orera ni wa, as for in us. Shin wa, as for sin, tao senai. We're unable to defeat. Tabun orera ni wa, shin wa tao senai. Tobas tai no yakume wa, shin kara, jin, machi, mura, hitobito o mamoru koto da. And so they're not able to defeat sin. However, Tobatsutai no yakume wa, so as for what the duty of the Tobatsutai is, shin kara, from sin, jin, temples. Machi, the town, Mura, the village, Stobito, the people, O, so doing something to all of them, Mamoru Kotoda. And Mamoru is to protect. So we're not able to stop sin, but what our duty is, is to protect the temples, the towns, and the people. Tobasutai no yakume wa, Shin kara, Jin, Machi, Mura, Hitobito o mamoru kotoda. Jo, dare ga Shin o taosunda? I don't know why, but Titus is really kind of reminding me of Luffy from One Piece. Maybe because I've been watching One Piece lately. But he just kind of asks direct, blunt questions without thinking about the other's feelings. He's a very kind of pure person, right? So, ja, well then, dare who? Shin, sin, or taosunda? Who's gonna defeat sin? Ja, dare ga shin o taosunda? Shin no dokuke ってのはこんなひどいものなんですか and Gata seems very surprised that Titus doesn't even know this because he says, Shin no dokuke te no wa. So, as for what is the poisonous gas of sin, Konna hidoi mono nan desu ka? So, konna, like this, hidoi means awful, mono, a thing, nan desu ka? Is it the case? So, is the poisonous gas of sin really this bad? Shin no dokuke te no wa, konna hidoi mono nan desu ka? Yeah, kore wa kanari hidoi. <laughs> but uh, I think they found out. <laughs> he says, Yeah, no. Kore wa, as for this, kanari hidoi. It's pretty bad. Kanari, fairly, hidoi, bad. So nah, this is pretty bad. This is not normal. Yeah, kore wa kanari hidoi. Oshiete yaru no wa kantan da ga. Dekireba jibun de omoi das ho ga ii. And so he finishes off and he says, Oshiete yaru no wa kantan da ga. So, oshieru te no wa. So, as for the thing of teaching, kantan, it's simple, daga. However, dekireba, if you're able to do it, jibun de, with yourself, omoidasu hogai. Omoidasu is to remember something, and then hogai would mean it would be better if. So, look, it's easy to teach you, it would be better if you try and remember on your own. Which is impossible, because he's not going to remember because he came from somewhere completely different. Oshieti yaru no wa kantan daga. できれば自分で思い出す方がいい。寺院へ行って祈りを捧げてこい。すべて思い出せますようにってな。寺院へ行って祈りを捧げてこい。So寺院へ行って寺院、the temple, 
2 marks the destination of action, itte go to the temple, inori o doing a prayer, sasagete koi. Now sasageru here is to offer something, like to offer your prayer. And there's very much a visual here of doing something kind of above you, like this, like a prayer. Because we can see in definition number one, it's to hold something above eye level, very much like a prayer to God, that type of thing. So you can see how it's connected. So inori o sasagete koi. So come and offer a prayer to the temple. Subete omoi dasemasu yoni ni tena. Subete everything omoi dasemasu. So that's to be able to remember your ni in order to or so that tena. So now quoting what you should pray. Pray that you'll remember everything. Jinye itte inori o sasagete koi. Subete omoi dasemasu yo ni tena. And that's the end of another huge episode of the Game Gengo vocabulary series. A huge thank you to everyone on the Game Gengo Discord community for voting for Final Fantasy X for the vocab series. If you'd like to vote on which game you want to see covered next, make sure to join the Discord community either through the website or through Patreon. Every month you can vote and make sure the game you want to see most gets covered in this series. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Thanks so much guys for watching. Sorry this one was a little bit late. I just moved to Fukuoka from Kyoto. It was very, very difficult. I've had to set up my whole new studio and everything, but now I'm actually in a room, whereas before I was in this tiny little box. <laughs> it was horrible. I can just show you very briefly that like the, the place that I've been editing all of my videos in for the past couple of years has literally been like smaller than Harry Potter's room from the movies. <laughs> I could extend my arm front left and right and it would touch the walls. It's horrible. Whereas now I am very 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 far away. I actually have space for a desk and I have lighting in the back and, and a window and oh my god everything's so much better. <laughs> so sorry for the little bit of delay in videos. I just moved. Getting accustomed to life in Fukuoka. It's such an amazing city. I love Fukuoka so much. And this is going to be huge for the future of Game Gengo because I'm actually going to be able to live a much healthier life which means I can actually focus on making more and more content. It was very unhealthy what I was doing before in this small little box unable to move my body. I was getting all kinds of health problems. So now finally being in a bit more of a physically active place is just so good for my health and it means that I'm going to be able to make a lot more content for a lot longer time without anything like burning out or anything as well as being able to live a healthier life. So hope you guys look forward to everything that's coming. Thank you so much guys for all of your support. If you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe and come join us in the Game Gengar Discord community. Thanks so much guys for watching and as always I'll see you again in the next video. See you guys. どうも。嬉しかった。今度こそ。だから
真の毒気にやられたかでもこうして生きてるんだエボンの賜物だなトレーニング続けてろ俺はワッカこのビサイドオーラカの選手兼コーチだな,、うん、なんだ腹減りかよし村行くぞなんか食わしてやるワッカはいいやつだと思っただから聞いてみたくなったんだあのさザナルカンドって千年前に滅びたんだよな今は遺跡になってしまったでいいんだよな昔々スピラにはでっかい町がたくさんあった夜でも賑やかな機械仕掛けの大都市だみんな機械の力に頼って面白おかしく遊んでたわけだだけどな見てみろ突然神が現れて機械の町を全部壊しちまったもちろんザナルカンドもなそれがだいたい千年前そうお前の言う通りだまあ神は調子に乗っちまった人間への罰ってわけだなまったくよ昔のやつらのせいで今の俺たちが苦労するなんて腹が立つよなあもちろん罪を償うのは今の人間の大切な役目だそれは分かってるさ、うん、でも時々やりきれなくなってなリュックの言った通りだったワッカもリュックも嘘をつく必要なんて全然ないんだ<笑>でもよザナルカンドエイブスってのは笑えたぞもしかしたらそんなチーム本当にあったのかもしれないけどよまあ楽して暮らしてた時代のチームなんて弱っちに決まってるけどねお前が落ち込むことないだろうが俺を励ましてくれるワッカの気持ち嬉しかったでもその時俺が考えていたのは始まりは真だだからもう一度真に会えばそれができたらザナルカンドへ帰ることができるかもしれないその時が来るまではここがどこかとかいつの時代だとか気にするのはやめよう気にしないってのは難しかったけど少しだけ楽になったほんの少しだけおいこっちだなんかあんのかにっああなにすんだよチームに入れてんだろもうすぐ大きなブリッツの大会があるスピラ中のチームが集まるでかいやつだでかい大会だからお前のこと知ってるやつらもきっと来るそしたらお前元のチームや生活に戻れるだろうなあ悪い話じゃないと思うぞどうだなあ,あいいよありがとうよ大会まで頼んだぜブリッツとシンだけがザナルカンドとスピラをつないでるような気がしたんだそんなに外れてなかったろこれはあそこで生まれて
歳歳でブリッツボールを始めた13歳でビサイドオーラカに入って10年選手ってやつだなでも10年やっても大会じゃ一度も勝てなかったんで引き際が肝心だってんで去年の大会を最後に引退したんだでな引退してから新しい仕事を始めたんだよなでもちょっと気抜いたらすぐブリッツのこと考えちまう10年間勝ちなしじゃな去年の1回戦はチャンスだったでもきついことがあって試合に集中できなかった言い訳っすね厳しいっすね次の大会で勝ってスッキリしたいそういうことか大会の目標は順位は関係ないんだいい試合ができたらそれでいい本気でやったって充実感があれば俺すっきりやめられると思う目標って聞かれたら優勝って答えろよ試合に出るなら勝つそれ以外何があるんだ優勝マジっすかおう海から来た人かこの道は魔物が多いから注意した方がいいよ真に近づいたのに助かったんだろうこんなところでやられるなよ誰討伐隊のルッツとガッタうん討伐隊お前そんなことも忘れちまったのか悪かった気にすんな俺が面倒見てやるうっすその代わり大会の時は大活躍してやるからうっすああ討伐隊のことは直接聞けよ村の宿舎にいるはずだビサイド村だ食べ物あるあとであの家で食わせてやるしばらく暇つぶしてろそうだなあ,あそこが討伐隊宿舎だルッツとガッタにいろいろ聞いてみろよあそうそうこっち来いな,なんだよお前いくらなんでもお祈りは覚えてるよな忘れたっていうか知らなかったんだけどさ生活の基本だろうまあとにかく教えてるうんほれやってみうんうんよし、上出来だじゃあ寺院の召喚師様にご挨拶してきなそれはブリッツボールの選手だったら誰でも知ってる勝利のおまじないだったなあ,あんた、真に襲われたんだろそれ最近か多分な。じゃあ、島の近くに真がいるのか隠してないよな。もちろんこの近くに真が来たのなら、島を襲いに来るはずだ。ところが、そんな気配はない。悪いけど、俺には何もわからないよ。だいたい、俺、討伐隊ってのも、なんだかよくわかってない。冗談だろ真の毒気かガッタ話してやれはい先輩
討伐隊は真と戦うために生まれた組織であるスピラ中に支部がありそこに志願した者は誰でも参加可能である討伐隊は800年前に英雄ミヘン様が作った石山州を起源とする後年組織を拡大し討伐隊と名を変え以来真と戦い続けているのである800年も戦い続けて真を倒せないのかああ討伐隊にできるのは真の進路を変えさせたりまあはっきり言ってその程度だ多分俺らには真は倒せない討伐隊の役目は真から寺院町村人々を守ることだじゃあ誰が真を倒すんだ真の毒気ってのはこんなひどいものなんですかいやこれはかなりひどい教えてやるのは簡単だができれば自分で思い出す方がいい寺院へ行って祈りを捧げてこいすべて思い出せますようにってな。